I think I think I think when you spread the wealth around, it's good for everybody. I think when you spread the wealth around, it's good for everybody. Hey Jim, you know the old sugar daddy. They be tricking their tell them girls. I said you can have whatever you like. I said you can have whatever you like. And I will raise the minimum wage. And I will raise the minimum wage. And I will raise the minimum wage, not every 10 years, but to keep pace with inflation. I will stop giving tax breaks to companies that ship jobs overseas. I will cut, I will cut, I will cut tens of billions of dollars in wasteful spending. I will, listen now, I will cut taxes. Cut taxes for 95% of all working families. So we're going to provide a $4,000 tuition credit every student. And I won't just talk about how great teachers are. I will reward, I will reward, I will reward them for their greatness by giving them higher salaries. And we're going to roll back those Bush tax cuts that went to all the wealthy people. And we're going to give tax cuts to ordinary families, people who are making less than $75,000. We will offset your payroll tax. I'll eliminate capital gains taxes for the small businesses and startups that will create the high wage, high tech jobs of tomorrow. I put forward a plan that says everybody will be able to get health insurance that is at least as good, that is at least as good, that is at least as good as the plan I've got as a member of Congress. Senior citizens who make less than $50,000, we want to say to them, you don't have to pay an income tax. You're already having a tough time making ends meet. We are going to raise fuel efficiency standards on cars because that is the only way that we can actually bring down gas prices over the long term. Well, Charlie, what I've said is that I would look at raising the capital gains tax for purposes of fairness, for purposes of fairness, for purposes of fairness. I get my chick and how she won't go to the store for any bag she won't. I know she never had a man.